so it's easier for us to blend it. See how it's, it's going a lot easier to blend it for the shading. But again, it's up to you, whatever you feel comfortable with. So I am just going to continue on with this. And let's see, I'm going to add a little more this way. Okay, now I'm going to do the baby elephant snout. Now we're just going to add some grasses down in the bottom right here. So you can either use your black lapin to do some of the finer grass lines or you can use your molotow. I'm going to start with my black lapin for some finer um, grasses. In this lesson, we're going to learn how to paint the beautiful, majestic peacock. It is one of my favorite birds. Now, this is a, um, we're going to be doing this lesson from a photo that I took at our local zoo. And we're going to begin by tracing the peacock, just the body and the legs, um, onto our Yupo. And then after we um, have it traced, then we'll go ahead and mask it. And then once that dries, we can begin painting. Okay, so now I have my peacock traced and ready to go ahead and do the masking fluid. So for this, I'm going to use the fine line resist pen. And as always, you want to get it started off on the side somewhere. And once it starts, you don't you squeeze it just to get it started. And once it starts, you're just going to allow gravity to release the um, fluid. And you're just going to outline the bird and fill him in with it. 